Hey everybody, what's going on? So, in this video I have a BMW right here that it's my wife's and I gotta get it to pass smog, but one of the problems is I'm getting an OBD2 code um, of a P0174, which basically means it's a it's lean, something's running lean, the oxygen sensor is picking up something, it's running lean, too much air, right? <clears throat> and in my experience, there's two things that usually cause this, okay? The MAF, which is right here, needs to, you, you pop this off right here. I'm going to have to pop this off anyway. Um, let me get a screwdriver. It's so fucking hot out here. This thing is like ridiculously boiling. <laughs> um, but anyway, inside here is the MAF. Let me get a screwdriver to pop that off. And uh, sometimes those go bad. Sometimes they're just dirty and they need to be cleaned. That can cause it. But the number one thing that I see, it's this damn boot right here, this rubber boot. Okay. And, um, I suspected that this thing is probably the cause of it and you don't always see the leak so you got to reach underneath sometimes and feel it you can spray WD-40 uh, carb cleaner you can use propane all sorts of stuff to try to find these leaks um, but this one it was blatantly obvious when I got down here let me kind of zoom in let me kind of zoom in here uh, come on focus you bastard I don't know if that's gonna end up focusing or not well, it's not going to focus. But if you look real close, but let me get a flashlight. Okay. Um, I don't know if you can see that. You see how that boot has come off inside there? I guarantee that's the, that's the cause of this leak. In fact, it looks like, it looks like, uh, I don't even see the freaking, I don't even see the clamp that's supposed to be on there. Bastards. Okay. So the clamp is fucking gone. And I guarantee that that's the cause of this. And then this also explains why my wife has been complaining of uh, the engine running rough. So <clears throat> in order for me to fix this, I have to take this guy out and I have to remove some of these things. Get inside there, put a new clamp on it, and I bet you it'll fix it. But if you're running into the uh, 0174 code, it's almost always this or this. And um, at least that's, in my experience, that's what it is. But always look for the obvious. And that is blatantly obvious. I can't believe the clamp is gone. Where the fuck is that? <clears throat> she took this in about uh, about a, maybe six months ago, uh, eight months ago, to have uh, some stuff replaced on it. Because I told her I didn't feel like doing it because it was just too much work and I didn't have the time. And whoever did it, <clears throat> they didn't put the fucking clamp back on. Communists. Well, in order for me to get to this thing, because the way that they ended up putting this clamp on, I had to take the DESA valve off. And one of the things on the DESA valve you want to look at is the uh, O-ring. Make sure that that is still in place and it's, it's good to go because that can cause a vacuum leak. Make sure that that little hole right there is cleaned out, right? But now that I see this, I can tell where they ended up putting the clamp on. They just did a shitty job and the clamp is actually back here. So the clamp is still there. I just have to loosen this up, take the clamp off, put this back on. But what's even better is when those sons of bitches worked on this, you know, I can see that we got this oil leak and my wife has been telling me, she's like, oh, I have to put oil in the car all the time. And I'm like, well, I don't see an oil leak, so you must be burning it up or something. And I look at this and I see fucking more shit that wasn't hooked up correctly. So I'm gonna have to tear into this thing in order to even fix the oil leak. It pisses me off because part of me wants to call that son of a bitch and be like, motherfucker, you're gonna fix this. But, uh, oh my God, it's always something. But anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. You, you know, I mean, oh, uh, good Lord. I think I'm gonna replace this hose because it looks kind of beat up. But um, uh, anyway, guys, 174, look for the obvious, right?